Your car is like your underwear. You don't let it out. Wow. <laughs> Unless you're kinky. Uh, I was supposed to go get my check and come back, and I didn't. I went downtown to buy some things, and my cousin said he was going to check on the car, and he took it and moved it. And when he moved it, they told it. My mom mad right now. I'm about to mop him up with that parking lot. You know, if your mother tell you something and you don't follow it, it's going to come back to bite you and you're behind later on. This has to be one of those situations. He's going to have to work and work until either A, she gets her car back, or he replaces the car that she can't get back. It works for me now. 30 minutes, come back. You know, what person you know take them 30 minutes in the gallery? It take you 15 of them minutes to get in the gallery, then the line. But I wouldn't even trust no 30 minutes not when we going into a store, because you don't even know how to line along the line in the store. I'm all going to take you more than 30 minutes, period. My son just had my car down at the 10th of Ludlow and they said he brought it here. So what's the total? I'm helping out. Dr. Lee, could you tell me what I need to come back to get my car? You need your registration, insurance, and your driver's license. Who was driving your car? Yeah. That's your son? Yeah, I think. <laughs> $317. Don't think you just paying for this now. You're going to pay for this for the next couple months. Every time she said, can I have some money, you probably just dig in your pocket. Christmas, New Year's, Easter. We're not even Jewish, Hanukkah. I think this is it right here. Here's my poke baby. <laughs> you feel like she want to run over him. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm about to hurt that boy. First of all, you didn't back it up no two feet. You Yo, moved, you it said like, you moved it to the corner. No, the corner is right there. It was too dark. I was all the way at the other corner. I was closer like, to the other corner, and no, you, you said you moved it up closer to that corner. Like, what, two feet, right? Behind the dumpster. Can you see the Godfather? <laughs> That's why they did not give Fredo the big jobs. This is Fredo. I'm back. I went home and called my son and got the rest of the money together to get the car out. And once I got it together, I called my other son to bring me back down here to get the car. That's when the time for the family to come together was the time of Christ. Good God. Ma'am, um, this is not a, like, like an official insurance card for, for Erie. Who put the plastic on? I got it like that. I received it so like that. So you got it like that? Yeah. That's a fake card. I wouldn't pull your leg on this, OK? Two pieces of card okay. put together, and then they put the paper on it. OK, thank you. OK, ma'am? Yes. She said she's been paying on it. So whoever she's given the money to, they're taking her over. It's not over until the fat lady say. It's a two-way street. That's a safety violation. The person can cause an accident when they drive off in the traffic. Sometimes you got to be real quick to avoid trouble. All right, man, ticket. Man, I ain't been in the house one minute. I seen my cat on the porch. I turn around and come back out. He's out here giving me a ticket. I just wrote the ticket, not knowing he's in the house trying to get the cat. Come on, mister. Come on. Mm -hmm. Now I'm going to be late for work because I got to find my cat. Mister. Mister. Gone. His cat's name is Mischief, so, so who's that fault here? Oh, um, sir. There it is right there. I thank you, brother. <laughs> uh, what are you running for? That's his name, Mischief. He's always doing something. He's always got constantly, constantly into something. Black cat's not trouble. We blame it on the cat. The cat's always to blame. Since it's his his fault, I'm going to have him pay the ticket. Expect for him to be in traffic court. There's a courtesy in the morning to drop the kids off between the hours of 8.30 or 9 o'clock. Now, it's way, it's almost 11 o'clock. That car don't have any business being right there. Man, they drop our kids up in school, man. Look at that lot over there. They park in that lot. That's here, everybody parking every morning. No, you don't. It's a bus drop off, sir. That's what the sign say. Oh. Keep going, man. Go that way. That is a public lot. He just told me 
they can't use the lot. That's, that's not true. She dropping her kid off. That thing say bus drop off. They ain't supposed to be right there. And you know that. She taking it to school. To school. There's a lot right there. What's wrong with them parking in their lot? You come here in the morning time, you can't get in that parking lot. A lot big enough to put 60 cars. Come out here in the morning when they running that stop sign. I can't get nobody no ticket for running no oh, stop well, sign. Oh, well, you giving tickets out now? Why, why are you even talking about it? Go get them a ticket. They stopped in the middle of the street and let his kids out in the middle of the street, and you ain't say You ain't got nothing to do with what I do. Well, where the police at? I can't get nobody no ticket for running no stop sign. Yo, they dropping their kids off. Man, stop cussing in front of that little baby. I cuss in front of anybody I want. I'm thinking, fuck you. Man, I'm on my job. I don't have time to talk to people like you. What you going to do? I ain't scared of you. You ain't got to be scared I, I, of me. You, you can get out your car and do whatever you want to do, bro. Bye, man. Um, people run that stop sign 24 hours a day. They punk asses won't stop no people like that. It was his father. <laughs> I should be pressing charges. It's my son. He let me borrow the car. And uh, I'm a speed demon from way back. He took my car keys, jumped in my car, drove off without a license. Philadelphia finest pull him over. No license, no insurance car. Car get towed. Enough said. <laughs> Um, yeah, my car was told. What kind of car is it? It's a 98 Mercury Sable. His car is nicer than mine. I wanted to show off. Take the keys with you now. <laughs> Don't leave the keys on the dining room table. Where was it parked? Now, someone was driving it without my permission. You want to know what happened that night? Yeah. I heard somebody was doing like 90 miles an hour down the sharp road. Boom, cops put on the side, like, woo, woo, woo. <laughs> I don't know. He got a good lawyer, though. <laughs> That's how we go. Okay, so you have to go to that line over there asking for a copy of the tow report. Get a tow report, then tow go to report, traffic court. And then you have to go to see a judge. <laughs> All right, then come back here. Right. Oh, wow. It's not about falling down, it's about getting back up. And right now we're about to get back up and get up out of here. <laughs> okay. The person with you didn't have a license, so the police had the vehicle taken. But you won't know whether or not you have to pay any of that until you go see a judge. Okay? Uh, do I get gas reimbursement for all this driving? You sure enough don't? No. Hey, no car washes or anything? Yeah, we'll get the paper from the judge. Uh, might be a fight. Damn, judge don't like us. <laughs> I'll be back. <laughs> They're wonderful, sir. It's so wonderful that coming down here to get the car out that dad borrowed, and they let dad come with him. <laughs> Well, before even going to traffic court, you got to get new tags, which cost you 85 bucks. <laughs> then you go to traffic court, they hit you with a $75 fee. <laughs> traffic court, where is that? There's a parking lot out there, labeled traffic court. Pull in, the guy says that'll be $5. <laughs> Another 237 unexpected dollars. This another line? Yeah. For what? Just to, just to receive your stuff. They don't want no more money over here, do they? Nah. Every line you get in, they ask for like $170 or something. Hi, why are you here today? <laughs> yes, <you are. laughs> what do you think I'm here for? I'm looking for a job. <laughs> OK, seriously now. I wasn't even driving the car. Oh, oh, OK. So you lent the car to somebody? No. He just drove it without permission. Took your car? Is this a friend of yours? Yeah. Well, he's not too much of a friend, is he? Right. Okay, did he go to court with you today? And pay all these violations? Some of it. At least he paid some of it. Did he promise to pay you the rest? Oh, uh, you're the guy? Yes. <laughs> okay. The guy will definitely pay him the rest. All right, so I'm done? No, sir. Your vehicle is at our Lot 2 location. Okay, we only keep them here for five days, sir. Okay, I need to send you around the corner to the auction holding lot. Really? Do I have to stay on the line again? No, there's no line there. Did you learn anything from this experience, sir? Don't drive in the city of Philadelphia. No, that's not in the right answer. You see that? They about to sell his vehicle. <laughs> they took it around to the auction lot, so we got to go before somebody bids. Let's go. <laughs> Why do you come 
ain't nobody ahead. Tell me they sent us around here and this place is closed. This is insane. How do we get the car? Yep. Yeah. Like I said. Sir, somebody's on their way over now, all right? OK, thank you, sir. You're welcome. There's a car on there for the auction? It's already on the auction block. They got an old five. They, they got, got an old old four Tahoe. And that's tomorrow auction. I might want to check this out. Hey, here we go. We're about to go home. Ah, it's a long process, though, ain't it? That's outrageous. I hope he doesn't let Dad use his car anymore. Dad's grounded. This car's been moved for nine payment of parking tickets. <laughs> this is gonna be real funny. <laughs> some of them do laugh and they say, yeah, I've been booted, yeah. In some cases, they might just laugh it all the way out. How much it cost for the booty to get off? Call that number at the bottom. You need to take care of it today. The vehicle's subject to be towed at any time. Any time? Yeah. The motor blown anyway. So who really won? <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad the citizen left laughing instead of fussing. I like those environments much better than the crazy environments. <laughs>